Welcome to this presentation on Retirement Services International, or as we call it, RSI. RSI helps people retire overseas. So why would you retire overseas? Well, we think that while there may be a lot of reasons, we think that there are three important reasons why you should at least seriously consider an overseas retirement. They are adventure, um, pleasant weather, and f f the financial aspects of overseas retirement. First, relocating and retiring in another country is an adventure. You meet new people, you discover a new culture, perhaps learn a second language, and it's all very invigorating or exciting. It's a, just a new phase of your life. And you get away from the snow and the ice and the cold. Because all of the places that we would recommend and be able to help you retire have very temperate climates. And you can stay in the beach or in the mountains where the temperature uh, is, while temperate, is not quite as hot as at the beach or in the faster pace of a, a world-class city. The financial benefits of an overseas retirement are extraordinary. All of these places have very low cost of living with first world amenities. And we really address two separate groups of people. Unfortunately, there's a rather large and growing segment of our population who believes that they can never retire, that they will have to work until they die. Well, we're here to tell you that's not true. Most people can afford to retire. The second group believes they can afford to retire, but they're concerned that they will outlive their money. By retiring overseas, as you will see shortly, you can possibly and probably continue to add to your nest egg, which is the best formula for not outliving your money. So if you want to retire overseas, where should you go? Well, we offer our services in three parts of the world. In Panama and Central America, or in Portugal and Southern Europe, or in Sri Lanka, which is in Southeastern Asia. And we will soon be adding countries to this list. But why those countries? Well, the countries that I just named and the ones that we will add in the future have very affordable living costs and low or no inflation. So your cost should not rise to exceed your income, which is relatively fixed. They all have a moderate climate. They all have stable governments, and they have a government and the people, the citizens of the country, are very friendly to expats. And which I know is a concern to most, if not all of us, they have state-of-the-art modern health care. And why should you use RSI to retire overseas? Well, we provide relocation planning here in the States to develop a, a package customized just for you. And then once you are in the country of your choice, we have our employees, full-time employees there to provide on-site concierge services to you to help you overcome all the cha challenges and obstacles that might you might think are in your way to becoming an expat. Our packages take care of the basics of a stay. Plus, we help you navigate the regulations, laws, and options involved in becoming an expatriate. We help ensure our clients' financial and retirement security 
and a primary goal of ours is to ensure that they do not outlive their money by exhausting their resources. We remove the operational complex complexity of making it happen and the financial hardships in retirement and enable people to live an enjoyable and sustainable life. And we work side by side with our clients in the country of their choice to ensure all arrangements, whether it's health care or pet care or whatever, are fully customized and in place and stay in place. So, we have four aspects to our process. The first, as I mentioned, is the planning, which takes place in the United States, so that we, we all know what your situation will be when you get to that country and uh, what your options are and what those options will cost. Then you take a eight-day tour of the country. If you decide after your eight-day tour that you want to have what's called a test ride, then you do a three- or six-month immersion stay in the country. And then after that, depending on your decision, you now can decide to retire in that country. <clears throat> as long as you're a client of ours, we will support you. You pay us one monthly payment for the services related to your package, which we'll discuss in a moment. And by the way, that payment can be paid from a U.S.-based account to us in Seattle. So you do not need to move all of your money to a foreign country. We pay all the bills related to the package and assist you to manage the non-package costs. And we help you with things like a housekeeper, a driver, a cook. And we connect you with doctors, dentists, insurance specialists, attorneys, and real estate agents. There are no other overseas packages like those provided by RSI. This is just a short segment of a long list of our concierge services it's that you won't leave all of them, but the ones that you do need, we're there to provide. So again, the three steps to retirement overseas are the six day and the eight day tour, the three or six month stay, and then retirement. And we're going to now use Panama specifically to give you some of these costs and uh, what you could expect. So step one of the process is to join us for an eight-day visit to Panama. Now the round-trip airfare, which you're responsible for, is approximately $900 per person. The cost of the eight-day visit is a little less than $6,000 per couple. If a single individual is going, it's less than that, but it's not down to half. And that cost includes your transportation while you're there because you're, for the first six days, you're going to be touring the country in a bus. And it pays for your hotel and it pays for your meals. Now, I want to emphasize this is not a real estate buying tour. We have no agenda to sell you anything except perhaps the concept and the idea of retiring overseas. After your eight-day visit, if you decide you want to uh, investigate that country more deeply, then we recommend a three- or six-month immersion stay. And based on your tour, you can decide where you want that emerge six, three- to six-month stay to be. It can be in the city. It can be in the beach or in the mountains or the other parts of the country and we will arrange for a fully furnished dwelling for three months. Now the cost for this day will be similar to the packages I'm about to show you but these packages are illustrative based on average situations and average needs for people um, visiting and taking this uh, emergency. 
I want to emphasize that your package will be customized for you before you ever agree and commit to go. But you can see, depending on where you want to stay, because rent is a major portion of these costs, but it's not all, that what it would cost you per month for two people to stay in these various locations in Panama. And what cost does the package cover? Well, first, and obviously lodging. It will be a, a fully vetted house, condo, or apartment in wherever you choose with a cleaning service and grounds maintenance and additional household help if desired. It will cover the internet, cable TV, and recommendations for in-country phones and data plans. It will cover transportation. And depending on where you are, you may want a leased car or just a, and a driver, or you may be able to use public transportation. And it will cover certain extras like Spanish classes, a personal chef, and in-depth guides to the local area are also addressed. And these packages do not include certain costs such as food, clothing, attorney fees, if you decide to travel while you're there for the three or six month stay, uh, it does not cover the cost of that travel or any accommodations that you use other than the basic log lodging that we provide for you. But as you can see, upscale living in Panama can be very affordable. The way it works is you send one monthly payment to us and we pay the package cost on your behalf. And specifically, again, depending on the package that we customize for you and agree with you that you will have, we pay for housing, transport, communications, a P.O. box, staffing for like a driver, a housekeeper, and a cook, language classes, and certain other amenities like a personal chef. And I want to emphasize again that the cost of these five packages that I just showed you are illustrative and are representative of average costs for each type of location and type of dwelling. And based on your situation, your costs may vary. And then after your three or six month stay, if you so decide, then you retire. And your monthly cost for retirement will be pretty much what we just showed you for the cost of the immersion stay. And we provide continuing support for as long as you remain our client. Now, I did want to specifically talk about health care. The Puta Pacifica Hospital, located in Panama, which is affiliated with Johns Hopkins, is the most technologically advanced medical center in Latin America. You will find out that the cost of medical and dental care is very economical. And also, depending on your age and your health status, health insurance can be a bargain. And you will need health insurance because Medicare is only available in the U.S. and cannot be used overseas, whereas your Social Security goes with you anywhere in the world. So we will recommend insurance brokers who can help you find the coverage and cost that's right for you. International health insurance is also available. You'll be pleasantly surprised when you see how affordable health care is in Panama. But that's not all. Even though the cost of living in Panama is very, very low compared to that in the U.S. You can't even spend enough to pay retail because they have a program, the government does, that makes you a pensionado, and you get a certain ID card, and you get discounts throughout the country in practically everything that you're going to spend money on. And you can see from this list what some of these discounts are, up to 50% at movies and sporting events. To become a pensionado, it takes about six months and may cost you uh, up to $2,000 in attorney's fees. 
All that's required to qualify is that you have no criminal record and they will run a background check, that you have an up-to-date passport, and that you have a verifiable monthly pension of income of at least $1,000 per month for an individual, $1,250 a month for a couple. And if you have more than just a couple, an additional $250 for each additional dependent. So how do you get started? What's your next step? Well, the first one is to go to our website at retirementservicesinternational.com where you'll find a wealth of information and many of your questions will be answered. And then you contact us and arrange for a complimentary one-hour phone conversation with a member of our staff to familiarize yourself with us and to get answers to any initial questions you have about us, our process, initial country questions, and what you should expect during the process. So contact us. The website is, again, retirementservicesinternational.com. In order to schedule your free one-hour consultation with one of our staff members, you would call this telephone number, and that will get you started. Or if you would prefer, you could always send me an email at bob.bennett at rsiadventures.com. Thank you for your time and attention.